I swear, it's been so long that I try a raw mango. Like this Oro mango. Like I don't think I've ever seen this kind of mango in, in Canada. Oh wow. And it's so expensive. Look at this. A tofu is two for two. Now this is like a small thing like this too that but I know it's very sweet. Like Oro mango. It's been so long. So I shall know that when we were young, when we are like babies too. So, not babies, like I remember this mango, oro mango, or oro ro, as I call it. We like used to drink it like buy this thing up here and then drink it. There are some people that will be like this. They squeeze the thing so the water came out and then they can drink it. I don't know if you guys are familiar, but anyway, I think this is the first time I've think taste this thing since since more than a decade ago. I usually see a tofu and the original mango. And one time I see gravel mango too, but this is oro mango. I don't know the English name, but wow, it is, it is good. Of course, we can't forget the rest of the mango, because this is part of mango. If you eat your mango and you're not licking this thing, you're not licking the seed, like lick it blank, lick it until it's white, you haven't finished the mango, like you're just being wasteful. So there's still some yellow, you know, so there's still some juice there. we we'll continue, continue. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my goodness. Mm -mm. See, like, say, this girl is village people. The, you know, no, village girl. But anyway, we should have tried. I tried. And this is how you finish mango. Then you go plant the seed. It's get of eating mango. You gotta lick the seed. Oh. Lick the seed. <laughs> green onions. Yellow and orange. No, no green onions. There's no there are no green onions there. There's just um, red bell peppers, orange and yellow ones and green ones too. And some habanero peppers and onions. But this one sent in all over but I'm just going to grind this oh my rice is cooking yeah 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 ah ah so you ricey fine I'm hungry some eggs as meat yeah I shall cook you have almost finished it all a lot of seasoning now. Oops. It's coming. Final ingredients. Oil. I did that makes all my eggs turn out this way. Look, they're all like they aft. Like when I threw for the first 15 minutes that I put them on the fire, the heat was so low, so it wasn't even it was just it wasn't even bubbling, it was just like oh, those tiny bubbles. And it was there sitting there for like 15 minutes. So I think that's what made it. It's just sitting there. Before I realized that it wasn't cooking. Yeah, I turned the heat up high and yeah. So it was just sitting there for some minutes and now it all turned out like this. Yeah, I guess kitchening is a learning process. Like seriously, kitchening is a learning process. I just want to add in here. Oof. That's not the one that I want to add. I'm going to add the rest of the veggies first. Before I add that, so we're gonna do that again. Yeah, yeah I wanted to add the rest of this first. And then, like, and then stir it really well. the 
if I add the egg and then the fish, then it might start to it must start to break the eggs. And this is the end of my cooking. I'm just going to let this sit on there for some time, maybe about 10 minutes. And then, yeah, that's the end of this cooking time. So <laughs> good. Chicken is seasoned. Yeah, I think that's all. Except I'm gonna add oil on that. And here is my two rice. I added onions, green onions. I don't know why I do this, but I feel like I don't know. I just add it. So I learned. I learned from my dad that you actually like. You actually also do this to two right like you have to stir it and like um you have to stir it like how you do amalan with uh, semo and all this i had no idea because the first time i did it i just like do shuku 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 like this and i was done but she it was like you actually have to stir it go all like this i think it's done it might be like Yeah, it feels done. It might just be that like I should leave it on on low heat for some minutes, so it um it steams completely. But honestly, like this is this is my second time. Oh no, it's my third time doing two rice. My third time. My very very third time. And yeah, you know it's June right now. And the last time I tried this was November last year. November? Yeah, that's quite a while ago. So I'm gonna add some water so it doesn't like start burning and all those. Because I wanna put it on, I'm gonna put it on low heat and to cook more shimon. I'm gonna put it on there and yeah gonna put it on there so it cook more thoroughly and yeah like so it's cook um no it's already cooked so it steams a little bit more yeah I'm gonna put it in. so it steams a little bit more like I'm not an Hausa girl, and I'm not, and I don't know if Ghanaian also do too, right? But I do love me some too, because if you go to school, and I went to school, this is our lunch, this is our breakfast, after the breakfast we had, we had at home. Now, this is ready to be wrapped and going to the oven. It's spicy. Uh, this is red pepper, green onions, onions, and habanero peppers. That's the fastest shopping ever. What? Oh, oh, I thought you were going to Ardennes. Oh. 
I originally bought this um, granite, peanut granite for Gary, but then it has this aftertaste, maybe because it has been in the bottle for so long, and you know, with all the preservatives and all that. So I didn't like the taste it comes out with Gary. I was thinking that with my um, tool, I'll just do the granite soup with this. It should. I think it should be okay. Hopefully it is gonna be okay. So this is all ginger, granules, red bell pepper, onions, green onions, happy new peppers, yeah. You can see this here. It's done. Thank God. I couldn't flip it before. I couldn't flip it around because it's going to take too much. But it, it's done anyway. So. It has like, I guess I had too much ginger in there and it has like this bitter aftertaste. But all in all, it's all good. I think it's going to go well with my to rice and my chicken so gonna see how that goes Some parts burn, but it's all good. As long as it tastes well, we're all good. I'm gonna enjoy my tour now with yeah with that chicken. Now I could put the chicken inside the soup, but I don't want to do that. No, I just I also have this tiny one that I can add here. But then we're gonna finish this first. I will probably eat that tiny one too, but. Yep. I will ask you to join, but how would you? But anyway, you can feed your eyes. Mm. Bye. Bye bye. So, salam alaikum and welcome to the channel. I'm meeting up my friend today. My friend from high school. Yeah, from high school. No, actually, not high school. From junior high. But, anyways, so I did this um, 
exotic um, lip, black lip liner thing and I don't know I feel like I felt like it's too much yeah the one, I mean I did the same look on it well not the same look because I didn't use any makeup on it but then I did the lip liner thing and black lip line and it wasn't bad because I didn't use I didn't use that much but today I used too much too much and look what's got me but uh, that's how it's gonna be today but am I enjoying my time am I enjoying my time so see ya later you can see my food but you can't see my friend and you can't steal her either so yeah so but you can see my food or you can see our food but not her now this is gonna be my first time trying in jail so I'll bring it on and let's see how this goes. <laughs> oh, the here? Yeah.